Good morning, everyone. Math Grade 3, First Term 21-22. And we have Chapter 2, Lesson 2, Part 3, which is talk about multiplication facts of 3. Multiplication facts of 3, we count by 3. Count by 3! Now, in our multiplication facts of 3, we can use our fingers by dividing each finger to 3 equal parts. Like this. First finger here from left, it will be 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 20, 21, 24, 27, and 30. If you notice here, we count by 3 not count by 1 because each finger is a 3 3 is 6 9 12 15 18 21 24 27 and 30 then the now let's go to learn our another strategy to find multiplication facts of 3 here we have double plus 1 group we noticed before that 3 pi is the is the yes rank of this table which is table 3 and the number after pi is the number of elements in these groups. Okay, is the number of elements in this group. Okay, we have here 3 pi 3. It means 3 groups. Each group has 3 elements. Now, to find our 3 by 3, we can use this strategy double plus 1 group. If we have double, it means 2 by 3. 2 by 3 plus 1 group, it will be 3. 2 by 3 plus 3. 2 by 3 equals 6, plus 3 equals 9. Another one here, 3 by 4, it means 2 by 4 plus 4. It means 3 groups. Each group has 4 elements. Then we will double these groups and add 1 group. It will be 2 by 4 plus 4. It will be 8 plus 4 equals 12. Here we have 3 by 5. It means that 3 groups, each group has 5 elements. Then we can double this and add 1 group, which is 5. 2 by 5 equals 10, plus 5 equals 15. So here we have 3 by 6, means 3 groups, each group has 6 elements. Then it will be 2 by 6, double these groups and add 1 group, it will be plus 6. 2 by 6 equals 12, plus 6 equals 80. Here we have 3 by 7. 3 groups. Each group has 7 elements. It will be double these groups. Then add one more group. It will be 2 by 7 equal 14 plus 7 equal 21. Then we have 3 by 8. It means 3 groups. Each group has 8 elements. Then we will double these elements and add one group. Then it will be 2 by 8 equal 16 plus 8 equal 24. Here we have 3 by 9, it means 3 groups, each group has 9 elements, it will be 2 by 9 plus 9. 2 by 9 equals 18 plus 9 more, it will be 27. And the last one here, 3 by 10, double the number of elements here, then add one more group. 2 by 10 equals 20, plus 10 equals 30. Then table 3. 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, and 30. Good job. Now let's go to use our array to find multiples of 3. We have here small, ar small arrays. Where we have name of the first array 3 by 1. It means we have 3 rows. Each row has 1 apple only. Then we have 1, 2, 3. It will be 1 plus 1 plus 1 equals 3. Then multiplication equation will be 3 by 1 equals 3. It means that we have 3 groups. Each group has 1 apple only. Here we have name of this array 3 by 2. It means that we have 3 rows. Each row has 
two apples only. Then repeated addition equation of rows, it will be two plus two plus two equals six. Then our multiplication equation will be three by two, it will be six. It means that we have three groups, each group has two apples. Okay, here we have name of this array three by three. It means that we have three rows, each row has three apples. Then the repeated addition equation of rows, it will be 3 plus 3 plus 3 equals 9. Then our multiplication equation from this name, it will be 3 by 3 equals 9. It means that we have three groups, each group has three apples. Now, the fourth one, name of this array, 3 by 4. It means that we have three rows, each row has four apples. Then the repeated addition equation, it will be 4 plus 4 plus 4 equals 12 then our multiplication equation will be 3 by 4 equals 12 it means that three up three groups each group has four apples three groups had each group has four apples okay now let's go to complete our uh, the list of these arrays in your booklet then let's complete this table using double plus one group strategy or your keeping strategy or your skip counting strategy as you want three by one three by two and so on until you reach three by ten then it will be three six nine twelve fifteen eighteen twenty one twenty four twenty seven and thirty good job excellent work